Hello and welcome to episode 31 of my No Man's Sky tutorial Let's Play series. So here we are, the second planet in my fourth system. And whilst this planet seems pretty peaceful and normal, if there is such a thing with such weird colours on the planet, um, apart from an odd storm or two, I have discovered my third alien race, namely the Gek. I have also located another crashed ship, so let's see if I am lucky and get an upgrade on my storage and maybe a message about the Gek. Anyway, so let's first take a look at this planet. So it's pouring with rain, well that's definitely like old Blighty, and the sentinels are passive, but don't believe that for a minute, because as soon as I start shooting up the uh, trees and stuff, they'll soon turn aggressive. And I love the way it said with that other pr planet that I was on that the sentinels were infrequent. And yet as soon as I picked one of them sacks, I got the most mightiest elite sentries after me that blitzed me anyway. So lesson learned there. Don't rely on what it says about the sentinels. They're all hostile. They just need a bit of coaxing. Anyway, so the rest is uh, flora is frequent and fauna is intermittent. So... Let's though go and have a look at this possible new ship. Now, am I feeling... That's good. Am I feeling lucky? Well, currently, just to show you, I have a 31 slot ship. And let's have a look if this is an upgrade. No, it's not. It's a downgrade. Now, Smilo mentioned a way of being able to strip these other ships of um, their resources, but I haven't quite worked that one out yet. Because um, you have to repair all of these first. So anyway, it's not, it's not an upgrade. No point in uh, trying to take anything. So I may as well leave it alone. Oh well. On to the next planet, I guess. Anyway, before I do that, let's show you this planet. So, you'll notice there is no damage meter going down on the left for my hazard suit or my health or anything like that. It's only when the occasional storm strikes. Now, let's see if we can communicate. Oh, this is Corvax. Well, at the transmission tower that got me here, when I did it, I got uh, faction with the Gek, so no doubt we'll see that in future episodes, more about the Gek. Uh, let's search the uh, crash site. Yeah, I think I've got all the technologies known to man now, so there we go. Right. The ship is a no-show. Let's just grab some resources. Yeah. And take a look at around the planet a little. Just to show you a little of it. Okay, so let's go to the edge. Because I'm in a crater. I actually managed to land in here instead of a few miles off in the distance for a change. There you go. I mean, there are loads of trees on this planet, so there's an extreme amount of carbon on this planet, just simply for the amount of trees. Raining a lot, that's really all you can say. Rain, lots of trees, and um, quite peaceful. So, if you wanted a planet that you can just walk around on and discover, this is the first one that I've found. Although, having said that, as soon as I step 10 yards away from my ship, the storm approaches. So, I will show you the storm before I leave here. You can see I've been going around doing a few things. I managed to upgrade my exosuit to 34 slots now. So, that's looking really good. It's just my ship I need to keep working on, really. And I don't do more than one distress. Oh, dang it! I don't do more than one distress, uh, one crash ship on each planet because it just gets a mess with all these these uh, thingies. I've even got them up in the sky now, all around me. It's just too. Look, see up there. 
I have to stop doing that because that does just make it so confusing. What is that? Oh, I don't know. It's on. There's the planet I was in the last episode, and um, there's six planets in this system. So that's maybe the next episode, and it'll be a good one. Or where's the rest of the episodes gone? They're out there somewhere. I'll find them. Um, you noticed my naming now? Oh, not that. Planet two of six. So that tells me what planet it is I've currently been to, and that tells me how many planets I'm looking in total. So the next planet will be planet three of six etc. That I found is much simpler way for naming my planets. As for the system names, yeah that's definitely stupid. Uh, the next system name will be called System 5 so I know how many systems I've been to. This is System 4 so I should have called it System 4 Gamester Euro 4 or whatever. Okay so there we go that's that. And this is this planet. Different, very different from all the previous planets I've visited. Um, not a, ro a lot really further I can interject I mean I haven't looked down in this cave here the last time I went in a cave I got I died with being shot at by them sentinels so yeah it looks like a cave system in there but really I just wanted to give you a glimpse of my second planet in my fourth system wherever you are in the galaxy God bless you and keep every last one of you safe Thank you for watching and have a fantastic day. Goodbye.